you are to be released. So I am to keep my earldom? Did you watch your son die? What about your daughter? Will you watch her suffer? Will you watch her die? Tell me, Berlin. Was it not worth it? We both have the opportunity to meet the King of England. <laughs> <laughs> Mary? And Anne Berlin. To your futures. You are cool, Mistress Anne. Am I? You have no claim on me, Master Wyatt. <laughs> Poor Mary. Poor us. When she was his mistress, all our fortunes were made. Now, most likely, they will fall. Unless... Is that it? Do you love another? Never ask of me. And never, if you value your life, speak of me to others. Do you understand? Oh, I almost forgot. Your daughter. The, the one who performed in our masquerade. Anne. Yes. Anne. No, not like this. How? Huh. Seduce me. Write letters to me. Ravish me with your word. Honestly, open me with a true heart. For me, that is the true definition of love. How do you like your charge, sweetheart? At first, I confess I did not like it so much. I did not care for the king. But now I... It is your duty to use his love to our advantage. to send you this token in return, small though it is, and allow me to remain, in all things, your ever-loving servant, Anne. Puta de lujo. I am no whore. I love his majesty. I believe he loves me. <laughs> the King of England writing to my little sister, promising to be her servant. It's incredible. Give me the letter. He's in love with you. Give me the letter! No. I shall honor your maidenhead until we are married. No less can I do for love. The daily proof you shall me find to be to you both loving. Now that I've taken power unto myself, I shall work day and night if necessary to resolve things, including my annulment. I swear to you now, everything will be different. It is the King's pleasure, by this patent, to confer on the Lady Anne Boleyn, in her own right and on her offspring, the noble title Marquess of Pembroke. With my every breath, with every fiber of my being, I love you and I am you. And I am yours. Now, my love, let me conceive. And we will have a son. I do solemnly crown you, Queen of England. Be to our Queen Anne. May you prosper, go forward, and may you bear a new son of the 
king's blood. To celebrate the birth of my son. I can't decide whether to call him Henry or Edward. What is it? What's happening? Nothing. Nothing. Her Majesty has given birth to a very healthy baby girl. I'm so sorry. You and I are both young. And by God's grace, boys will follow. Another gift for you. Hmm? I am with child again. Oh, my lady. Oh, what is it, lady? Your Majesty, oh, lady. Your Majesty, lady. What is it? Oh, I'm not. I'm not. What did you do to kill the baby? I did it. From now on, we must all be careful. You especially. Not to lose the king's love. Or everything is lost. Will you come to my bed tonight? Don't you know I love you a thousand times more than Catherine ever did? And don't you know that I can drag you down as quickly as I raised you? me. We are on the edge of the golden world. I'm carrying the king's son. Lady Jane. some rumors about the Queen's behavior. It seems she just takes men in her room. I am innocent, Mr. Cromwell. I swear to you. This is the warrant for your arrest. You are charged with committing adultery with Mark Smeaton, Sir Henry Norris, and William Brett. I have just heard of the Queen's arrest. My mind is clean amazed. I cannot believe that she is guilty of such abominable crimes. My child, do you have a confession? Yes. I confess my innocence before God. Oh, it's very quick. She feels no pain. Monsieur? You will be not disappointed. I'm sure. Acquit yourself of your charge, for I've been long prepared. Will you and your ladies follow me? Thus I take my leave of the world, and of you. And I heartily desire you all to pray for me. Oh, Lord God, have pity on my soul. To Christ, I commend my soul. Jesus Christ, receive my soul. Oh, Lord God, have pity on my soul. God of infinite goodness, send prosperous life and long to the high and mighty Princess of England, Elizabeth! I am mother to my people. God, give me strength to bear this mighty freedom. I am your queen. I am myself. <laughs>